Hi, Mom. Hi, Mom. Yeah. Kelly, I am so glad you're home. I'm entering this new contest, and I need you to think of something clever. <laughs> But is something wrong? Yeah. yeah. You just asked someone with the IQ of mustard to think of something clever. I will have you know, a oh winged monkey man, <laughs> that I am just as smart as anybody else in this room, so you don't need to spell out Iqui around me. <laughs> but I'm so glad you're home. <laughs> you see, this feminine hygiene company is looking for a sidekick for their new mascot, Tubi the Tampon. <laughs> you got any ideas? Mom, in Bud's defense, you're talking about an area he knows nothing about. <laughs> now, if it had been for hand wigs or, say, finger lingerie... Hey, uh, <laughs> I think that's quite enough, Kelly. Mom, I thought Dad banned you from entering all these magazine contests. I don't enter that many contests. I don't even get that many magazines. Mail call! Well, let's see what came today. Doll maker, <laughs> lizard quarterly. <laughs> oh, look here, ebony. Esther Roll moved, Peg. <laughs> Closer to the fridge. <laughs> oh, now, what have we here? Amish Weekly, ooh. New spring color, black. <laughs> Mom, are you sure anybody ever wins these contests? Would Ed McMahon lie? Gee, I don't know, would he drink? <laughs> would he laugh at something that's not funny? <laughs> would he tout the taste of dog food if he thought he could make a stinking buck? <laughs> I'm telling you that nobody ever, ever wins these contests. Hi, I'm Wolfman Jack. <laughs> Let me in, I'm gonna blow your mind out. Anybody here join a record club? Uh... <laughs> Uh, you know, I'm talking about 30 years ago. <laughs> no, I'm here to lay something good on you. You guys have just won our $1 million grand prize. Oh, 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 oh. Peg, if you weren't my wife, I'd kiss you. <laughs> Congratulations, Mrs. O'Sullivan. <laughs> Isn't O'Sullivan. Mine is top of the morning to you, Wolf Mammy Lamb. <laughs> uh, listen, Lojack. Uh... That's Wolf Man, Jack. Yeah, yeah, much cooler. <laughs> listen, our name is Bundy. Yeah, B U N D and sometimes Y. <laughs> oh, listen, Mrs. Bundy, you have just won first class accommodations on our luxury cruise to the Caribbean. she won? Because she wrote the most inspiring essay for New Widows magazine. <laughs> New Widows, Peg. So you do share my dream. But you know, I don't want to go on a cruise by myself. Hey, Mr. Wolfman, don't you think you could just bend the rules a little bit so that Al can come? No! Please. <laughs> Man is unimpeachable. His character beyond reproach. He combines the best qualities of both wolf and man. It's 50 bucks in it for you. Sold. I tell you what, I'll take this first class ticket and I'll change it in for two economies. But, Peg, I don't want to go on a cruise. All that rocking up and down, side to side, I'll be throwing up all night. And then there's the motion of the boat. 